Hi, Tag Enthusiasts! Welcome back to our channel, Fast Cabling. Today in this video, we are diving into an exciting aspect of modern civilian system, human detection. So to start, let's take a look at this video feed. Now here we have a person walking out of an elevator, that's me, and notice how the human shape is detected. Now let's talk tech. Traditional motion detection system in security cameras are pretty common, but they often struggle with accuracy. Why? Because this system are generally triggered by any significant movement, which can include anything from moving shadows to animals, like your cats or dog, and this often results in false alarm and potentially compromised security. So this is where human detection technology steps in. Unlike conventional motion detection, human detection systems utilize more advanced algorithms to specifically identify human shapes and movement. And this dramatically reduces the false alarm and enhances security and efficiency. Now, if you've been thinking about upgrading your security system or just starting out with one, we're here to help. We are giving away free tag design for a customized security system. That's right, absolutely free. And this design will be tailored specifically to meet the needs of your home or business environment, ensuring you get the most efficient and effective security setup. So just click the link through the description box below and send us your question. So now let's break down how this works. Human detection technology often includes facial recognition capabilities, enhancing its precision, and the system uses complex algorithms to analyze the capture video feed for human characteristics, such as head shape, body contour, and movement patterns. And for our setup today, we are using this 2.8 to 12 millimeters motorized lens bullet camera connected to a PoE switch, to a NVR, and a router. And these components work together seamlessly to provide a robust and reliable monitoring. So the motorized lens bullet camera allows for zoom and focus control, which means you can manually adjust the field of view and focus. And the variable focal length ranging from 2.8 to 12 millimeters provides flexibility in covering a wide areas or zooming in for detailed images. And its bullet design makes it ideal for outdoor use thanks to the robust and rather resistant casing. And here we have the NVR. The NVR is the brain behind the operation. It receives the video feed from the camera, stores it, and allows for viewing and managing the footage. And our NVR are equipped with advanced processing capability to handle human detection algorithm effectively, ensuring the system only alert when a human is detected, not every time a cat walks by. Now moving on to the PoE switch, which stands for Power Over Ethernet. This device is key for a streamlined installation. It powers the cameras over the Ethernet cable and facilitates the data connection between the camera and the NVR. And this means you don't need separate power supplies for each camera, reducing clutter and simplifying the installation process. And lastly, the router. While the NVR and the cameras can function without internet for local recording and monitoring, the router is still essential for enabling remote access and notifications. It connects your security system to the internet, allowing you to view live video feed, receive alerts, and manage settings from anywhere in the world through our dedicated Green Backyard application. And the applications for such a sophisticated system are vast. Whether it's a warehouse, parking lot, or construction sites, human detection feature can significantly boost security and operational efficiency. So now let's jump into how you can activate the human detection feature on your NVR. So 
So the setup is pretty straightforward. All you need to do is add a mouse to the NVR and we can get started. Now looking at my big screen monitor, I can see the mouse moving, just right click it, we can navigate through the menu. Go to the main menu and the record configuration. I already checked all the boxes. It will start record when it detect movement and also send your alarm as well. So make sure you click the boxes here, select the channel. This is the time, week and period. You can select it whatever you want and then hit OK. After that, go to alarm and here we have intelligent alert. Click on it. This is the enable button. By clicking it, we are enabling the human detection feature. Select the channel. The bullet camera is on channel one. Today, we are not going to show the face detection, so let's uncheck it and check the human detection. It will start record when it detects a human and also give you mobile reported and has alarm sound. I already checked all of those. And for sensitivity, I put it in the middle not too low, not too high, middle will just do. So everything is set, hit OK, and go back out. Now on the right upper, wait, this is not upper, the lower right hand corner, we can see the record image. It turned red, that means it is now recording. And I'm going to move in front of the bullet camera. So now you can see me. And also when you look at the right corner, right here, you can see there's a little human. It's on whenever it detects a human movement. So now I'm going to go back again, right click it, playback. Here we have the common playback and also the smart search. Today we're using smart search. It will bring us right away to a human movement. So I'm pretty much sure this is the video I just recorded. Me pointing at the lower right hand corner. So this is how you activate the whole human detection feature. Now, once everything is set up, the system will alert you only when a human is detected. And one of the best part is all this detection process happens locally in the camera system. This means even without internet access, your security is uncompromised and your data stays private and secure, not floating up in the cloud. However, if you need remote access, internet connection becomes essential. So now let's take a look at our dedicated Green Backyard application. So this is our Green Backyard application. It allows you to view and manage the human detection setting from anywhere. Now we are looking at the same channel, which is the bullet camera. Not only you can play back, you can also set the human detection feature. Just go to setting. Go to smart alarm. Now it's off, so we are going to turn it on. You can also adjust the sensitivity. Go back out. We are going to turn on the human detection. If your NVR support car detection, you can turn it on as well. Now let's enable human detection feature and click on the alarm bell. That means it will send your alarm and also we can click on capture image. That means it will, tr it will start capturing image and record video when it's triggered. And it's safe, you can set your alarm period. You can set it in the 24 hours or you can customize the alarm. So now the alarm is on. So now the human detection feature is on. First, I'm going to lock the screen of my phone and then I will walk under the bullet camera. And as soon as I walk under the camera and the camera detected human movement, here is, is the notification. All you need to do is click open, plug in your password, and it will send you the message when it detects human detection. You can play back and now you can feel the video footage. So 
So there you have it. From setup to operations, human detection not only simplifies security but enhances it, providing precise, efficient, and reliable surveillance, and perfect for today's security need. Now, thank you very much for watching today's episode on the importance of human detection in civilian system. Before you go, please don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell to stay updated with our latest in tech. And if you have any questions or feedback, feel free to drop a comment below. And I'll see you in the next video.